Hello students, this is a class for BA part 3 and we will be talking about the battle of cowshed in the novel Animal Farm which is written by George Orwell. The battle of cowshed is an interesting event of Animal Farm. Animal Farm is actually a fable novel written by George Orwell. You all know what a fable is. Fable is a story in which animal characters behave like they are human beings. So in this novel, Orwell successfully unifies his political thought and artistic purpose. The book is actually an attack on Russian revolution. The novel begins with a sudden urge for revolt against man's tyranny by animals on a manor farm. Old Major, the name of a pig, a, a, the, the senior most pig, becomes the prophet of the revolution by animals to overthrow man's tyranny. The experiment is quite successful and the animals on the farm of Mr. Jones, which is called Manor Farm, drive out their master. They take over the administration of the farm, which is now changed into animal farm from manor farm. The turned out master of the farm, Mr. Jones, then spends most of his time drinking wine at some club and he tells his misfortune to every possible listener in the club. The incident was already spread across half the country and the owners of the neighboring farm houses were much worried of this influence upon their own animals. Nevertheless, the stream of rebellion and the tune of Beasts of England, which is like the uh, song of animals liberty, it was spread all over the countryside in a short time. To stop this influence from upon, upon other animals, a combined force of neighboring farms, especially the Foxwood and the Pinsfield, the men from there are prepared in the league of Mr. Jones. In the beginning of October, when hay was cut in the animal farm, Mr. Jones with six men attacked upon the farm to recapture it. The animals had already anticipated it, so they were quite ready to answer it. In the supervision of Snowball, who made the preparations being inspired by the book of Julius Caesar's campaigns, war campaigns, as soon as the men arrived in, Snowball launched his first attack. All the pigeons made a flight upon the men and muttered upon them, while the geese pecked at the, their calves. After this, Snowball launched his second phase of attack. Muriel, Benjamin and all the sheep pushed and kicked them badly, but the sticks of men proved heavy upon them and kicked them badly. But the, but the sticks of men proved heavy upon them and they could not remain facing them for a long time. Then Snowball gave a loud squeal and all the animals went into the yard. Viewing this, the men gave out a shout of happiness and they thought that it was their victory. But... As soon as they, the, the, the people from Foxwood and Pinchfield in the leadership of Mr. Jones gathered into the yard, three horses, three cows and all the pigs who had been lying in an ambush dashed upon them. Snowball rushed to Mr. Jones. Mr. Jones had a gun. He fired the gun and pellets wounded Snowball. A sheep was also killed. Without stopping Snowball, 
he flung his heavy body upon Mr. Jones, who fell into a pile of mud and his gun far away from him. On the other side, a stable boy was dropped almost dead by the blow of Boxer, the, the horse, uh, when he, he kicked him with his iron shoes. That sight terrorized the men and they found it unable to continue fighting. So they took to their heels from Animal Farm. All the animals chased them up to the main road and in this manner they won this battle. After this, all the animals gathered in the big barn and held a celebration of victory. The flag was hoisted and Beasts of England was sunk many times in jubilation. A military decoration, animal hero first class was conferred upon Snowball and Boxer, whereas animal hero second class was conferred upon a dead sheep posthumously. They called this battle by the name of Battle of Cowshed as it was operated and fought in the cowshed. In the last, they fired the gun which was found in the mud and decided to fire it twice every year on the anniversaries of the rebellion and on the anniversary of the Battle of Cowshed. In this manner, we can describe the Battle of Cowshed in the animal farm. Thank you very much.